morning guys if you guys can hear Fitz crying upstairs it is because Coco is downstairs he just like cries anytime he's not attached to her side and then he tries to attack her he just doesn't get it. Anyways, um, Sab is here. She slept over. His crying is like the worst. It's, he's never cried this much before in his life. His life is three months. Coco is about to go to the VET, guys. It's very sad, but we love her. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so cute. But anyways, I'm currently uploading um, yesterday's vlog. Oh my gosh, welcome to the last vlog of vlog week. Very exciting vlog today, guys. Um, I'm working from home. We're gonna do a little strawberry field taste test versus a strawberry drink that you guys think is similar. So I'm gonna be the judge of that and that way you guys can get your drinks because this is literally my number one requested thing. Um, if you guys are not aware, it's the best drink ever. I think she definitely knows. Hi. Thank you. My poor dog. Guess what? Today is tax day, so I might just cry when uh, taxes come out of my cup. <laughs> So, what about you guys? How are you feeling? You guys know, well first off, can you speak? Vlogging is hard. First off, we are at La La Land to get a strawberry field. Coco uh, was at the vet and she's gonna be there for a few hours and we're a little bit concerned for her. She's just like not happy about where she's at today. Her her like Thursday morning plans are just like it's not it. Day. Her Wednesday morning <laughs> plans are just not it. But a lot of you guys have been getting this other Starbucks drink saying that it's similar to the strawberry fields. And I'm sure that it is, but a lot of you guys have been asking if it actually tastes like the strawberry fields because obviously only I have La La Land in Dallas. So we're gonna get the strawberry fields at La La Land and then we're gonna go get this drink at Starbucks and I will tell you guys if they're similar. That was a lot of explaining though. I feel like I could have just said in two seconds. Yeah. Okay. Where's our hard stuff? I just can't really talk. The I have my diaper mask. This mask literally looks like a diaper. It's like way too big for my face. I also have like this. Like my ear. Sav and I were talking and we think masks are kind of fun. Like, yeah, they're kind of in. They're kind of in. They're like, like, stylish. First off, if you're not wearing a mask, uh, <laughs> I don't want to be rude, but like just why? why? Like just freaking wear a mask. Like here's the thing. I mean, obviously masks do help, but like let's say that like masks actually did not help in the slightest. Blah blah blah, whatever. We know they do. We know that they do, but even if they didn't. But it still is like that. there's a small chance that you're gonna save someone else's life? Yeah. Wouldn't you just be like, oh, down to wear the mask? Like, you, what's you the argument? Think. You would think that people would be like, oh my gosh, yeah, of course. I have more to say, but I don't wanna say it on camera. Yeah, exactly. Like, I'm trying to be like really nice about it, but like wear a freaking mask. Anyways, we're just gonna kind of fun. They're like, like kind of flirty. Like, they kind of flirty. If you have a pimple, great cover. Exactly. No one will know. Uh, sometimes you can put on sunglasses. It's like your hometown dream. Cause you'll never look. Disguise me and target. No one so will no ever one recognize you. Me. <laughs> no one will ever recognize you. You don't have to run and do the run-ins that you don't want to do. Also, guys, look at these earrings, so cute. I'll have the link down below. Use Kinsey 15 for 15 percent off. But anyways, it's honestly kind of the dream. Just yeah. gonna, I wish I'm that I had this about two or three years ago. I you know. With the <laughs> oh, it's just so beautiful. So much. My pleasure. You guys enjoy. It. Thank you. You want this to, we can just do one if you don't drink out of the straw. Okay. It's just a stir. Wow. So beautiful. <laughs> wow. Leaving Mala Land. Sav even got one and she normally doesn't. So this is exciting. Exactly what I needed at 9 a.m. <laughs> Literally. Well. Oh. <clears throat> oh wait. Perfect. Oh, it works. Okay. Um, wow. Sav and I are not a fan of the tie-up mask though. You gotta get the ones. Yeah, this was the first like mask I had that I used. And I still do if I don't have my like regular mask, but yeah. But it's just like it's more just of a hassle. hassle. And so, I'm not good at tying things. So. Yeah, yeah, that's an issue. Yeah. Also with these though, I get these stuck in my hoops often, but it's a price I'm willing to pay. Guys, so Kennedy Warden tagged me in a story and she went to Starbucks and she got half pink drink, half matcha latte iced from Starbucks and was like, okay, if you guys wanna make the pink drink, it's like this. So we're gonna do a little taste test because we have our actual pink dirt. We have our actual strawberry fields. strawberry fields drinks. And obviously Starbucks is like accessible to all of you and not La La Land. Only the absolute best drink that's ever so happened. Good. Let's see. Also important to get it with oat milk, just saying. 
Okay. In her story, it was pink, but I'm assuming, like, sometimes this one's pink too until you mix it, so. Honestly, it tastes nothing like it. No. <laughs> yeah. It's not bad. It's I not like the bad. Pink drink, yeah. But, like, it's a good drink. It's not the same, though. Yeah. So, back to my quest for finding um, strawberry fields for all of my non Dallas girls um, and boys. And boys. But I would highly recommend just moving to Dallas. Yeah. <laughs> That's basically what we're getting at. Yeah, and we're gonna go get chicken minis. Very exciting. I haven't had chicken minis in so long. God bless. All right guys, so I'm ready for the day. I'm about to start filming, but I want to make some avocado toast for lunch. I've recently, perf go back. My Brita is filtering water right now, but I have recently perfected my avocado toast at home so i'm gonna show you guys how i've been making it it's so simple but it is seriously like so freaking good okay i'm totally kidding um turns out my avocados are like not ripe at all but i will show you guys what i've been using um this trader joe's glaze it is so freaking good so i will just um squeeze some of that on top and then of course i top it with the everything with the bagel sesame seasoning blend it is so good guys and then i will use either sourdough bread or gluten-free bread i love gluten-free bread and i love how it's so small but honestly this is just so bomb that i end up making more and it's just like unreal i cannot describe how good it is all right guys i just filmed my video of outfits to wear when it is like you know 100 degrees out because that's pretty much what it is here um i'm about to go record the intro for this week's episode which is up today actually guys so go listen to it it's with nasi lunken the olympic gymnast gold medalist actually Whew, i'm like really really on one guys i just never do like sit down style videos anymore and i actually like really really want to and i just yeah new videos are coming i'm very very excited i'm just cleaning it up because it is such a mess like when you're actually done, finally, I'm not even done because QS takes some photos of me, but like all of this was everywhere and now it's just here. So great. Okay, just recorded the intro. Who I'm sending all of that stuff over right now to my editor. Who just called me? Oh, Dom called me. Okay, I'm about to call her back, but guys, Coco's vet bill. $700 and she's gonna have to go back in a month and it might still be that expensive <laughs> so I'm gonna be selling my soul pretty soon uh, that's the plan listening to a podcast I need to shoot some photos I need to like get on my Instagram game I'm just doing like random work stuff today that I've been needing to do basically just like shooting a ton <sighs> oh my gosh I just realized my Sephora package came in I'm so excited <laughs> I brought all these boxes up and I didn't look at who they're from. Guys, my realtor just dropped off the cutest gift. Oh my gosh. It's like a Chewy Vuitton. Oh, perfect for Coco because she needs this. She needs a toy today. Oh my gosh. So, so Oh, she got me a La La Land gift card. I'm literally going to actually cry. Guys, oh my gosh. I'm literally crying. Okay, I need to take a photo. I don't know when this stopped recording. I was talking, I don't know, okay, did they give her food? Yeah. Okay, so Coco's going on a different diet. Don't hurt her. Fitz. So this is for Coco. It's a cute little chewy baton. We love this. Fitz got this really big bone. Look, this is for you. He doesn't, he can't tell you. And then. It's really so big. Such a cute mug. I always need more mugs. It's the cutest little journal. I already looked through this when I was downstairs, so I'm just. Oh my gosh, guys, a Lala Land gift card. I'm literally gonna cry. This is the best day of my entire life. And then a makeup brush. Oh, oh wait, I actually really, really need this. That's incredible. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Anyways, if you guys need a realtor in Dallas, um, I have the best one ever. And if you guys are actually looking to move to Dallas or anything like that, join our Facebook group because it's like half of it is people who are trying to move here. Um, but I can connect you with my realtor. She's the best ever. I do shoes last week. Kids. Look how cute. He's so big. I know, he's so big. Cute. Do you like my new shoes? Oh, they're so dope. Yeah, aren't they so cute? These will be really cute with all my dresses too. Would have been good for the video I just filmed. Oh my gosh, okay, Kapari. It's a hydrating body wash. I am actually so excited to try this. Kapari is like one of my favorite 
brands. I love their like coconut stuff. I'm excited to try this because I feel like body washes actually dry me out. So let's see. Coco, we have matching purses now. How do you feel about that? Oh my gosh, we have to get a photo of me with like a bag with my Louis and then Coco with her Louis. It's really important for today. That's iconic. Okay. So I know. That's what I keep saying. And no one, everyone keeps telling me he's not growing. Uh, yeah. So this just might be the best day of my entire life. Got my glow screen refill. We know I can't live without this. And then I got two Summer Fridays so I can keep one in my bag, one in my nightstand. I thought ahead. Um, this is the lip butter bomb. I'll have it linked down below. I'll link up all this stuff down below, but oh my gosh. I can even try to link one of the Chewy Vuittons. I know it's probably gonna be hard. Actually, no, I can find one. It might be hard to find that exact one, but I can find some if you guys are looking to get your dog one. But And then another one, we love this. Oh my gosh, wow. What a great little afternoon pick me up. This little unboxing haul, so fun. Black opium, guys, I need a new perfume. I'm actually completely out of perfumes right now and I love them and I feel off. So tell me what I should get next. Let's try this one. Why sell black opium? Great. Guys, look at how cute he is, the angel. He's been out and about all day. He needs a nap. Love you. We just took some pics in the office. Proud of me. Quentin loves me and he ordered me. Oh my gosh. Is this the. F no, this is the 32, right? Guys, I just cannot get over Smoothie King sizes. Like, that's actually absurd. Sometimes I'll get the 40 ounce just because if you spend $10, it's free. I was gonna say free shipping. It's free delivery. Um, So good. DoorDash code linked below as always. Also, I really do truly just think that these shoes are so cute. I'm gonna style them with dresses, even athleisure looks. Oh, these would be so cute with like a pair of like boyfriend jeans and just like a white tank top. Really into that idea. I think that's so cute. These are just the best. And I'm a great chef. I think that we're really well on the verge of getting Caleb a wife. Guys, oh, she's beautiful. Oh my gosh. She's so pretty. What the? Yo, Caleb is about to be. Caleb, what a lucky guy. Uh, so, um, in yesterday's vlog with Caleb and then on the podcast and stuff, I'm trying to get Caleb a wife and you guys are sliding into my DMs about him. So, that's at Caleb Nash Feimster. She said, what a man. Mm-hmm. Wow. We love this. We absolutely love Wait, does she do outdoor activities? I don't know. This is my, uh, he's got to figure that out. True. This is true. This is true. We sent a video of the video she sent me so that he could see. Literally says, hook it up. Oh, love. <laughs> Quentin sent the ring emojis in our group chat. Guys, I cannot explain to you what just happened here. So Coco is on a new food for to treat her right now. She has bladder stones. And she, I mean, Quentin. She was like a wolf. Like, a, I've never seen anything like it. Like, like I've never, I am what do you a mean, King girl? German Shepherd in Florida. Never seen it. No, off. she like got the food and the food flew everywhere because, but she's eaten all of it. Because she came in well, like that's this. That's awesome because she eats in one like, heat in like, okay. Can't Coco, drink action. your water. We're feeding her on the table right now just because her and Fitz are eating separate foods. So we just, I don't know. We have a very exciting package. For? For? The queen herself. The right queen on. herself, Coco. Look. Oh my god, she, she's literally trying to get the remainder from the spoon. Oh my gosh. Get a little. Yeah, please get a close up. Can I get a little zoom action? Little zoom action. Oh my gosh. Do what you can. Okay, Coco. Oh my gosh, this is from Neon Cowboys. <laughs> Guys, this is so cute. Vegan Ranch from Melissa Would Help Style that I'm gonna be making. Coco. I have it. Cowgirl Coco. Wait, back me. Fit. <gasps> hey, gentle. Cute. Got a dolly t-shirt. Letters and Lucy, the Instagram handle, or it's just lettersandlucy.com. <laughs> and dolly we trust. And Guys, dolly trust. Oh, my gosh. dolly stuff is like taking over. Oh my gosh. You Peep can have the, your uh, space cowboy. Smoothie king over in the corner that we crushed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can have your space cowboy, Casey. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. And then, <gasps> A doodle mom. 
So true. Fitz, did you see this? They're proud of me. He loves me. I'll drink it some water. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Okay, so that's Letters and Lucy. This is Amazon Fitz. Basics. Just gray zip up. It said these weren't coming for like two more weeks, but I just needed another one to throw on. So I have a package from Verge Girl. I love their stuff. Ooh, cute. I need you to see this for me already. Ooh, cute. Oversized blue blazer. Love. Also, it's thin and it feels like really good. Oh, oh yeah, there's a matching skirt. Oh, it's really thin too. Okay, so that's really cute. I mean, it obviously needs to be steamed, but it'd be cute if I have like white, the Balenciaga heels that we were just, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. With that outfit, that'd be really cute. Country club sheet. That's kind of like more clueless. Oh, and then this, cute. This is the top, which these are like never big enough for me, so we'll see. And then matching bottoms. Ah. <sighs> Today's portion of the vlog is called paying my taxes and crying. I know that we're all on this one together. Not all of us, I guess. My US people were all on this together. Honestly, it's like, yeah, obviously the large lump of money that comes out of your account is horrifying. But it's even more annoying because I just feel like it just shouldn't be as confusing as it is, especially when you are like self-employed and blah, 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 whatever. It's just not fun not fun at all so i don't want to lose this money as much as the next person but it does make me like feel like a real adult and really responsible and like on my stuff when i go and do like a real thing you know what i mean also to make you matters even better i have really bad cramps but today has just been a shooting day so i filmed for a few hours then we took a bunch of photos um i've been over here i've been over here brainstorming for a new thing that will be actually coming out soon and yeah i just have been having like really really bad cramps like i don't know what's up i mean i guess i do we put on um unsolved mysteries i've been watching i've only watched like two or three episodes but it's really good it's on netflix honestly okay so tonight it's 6 p.m honestly vlog week has like worn me out vlog weeks are weird because it really messes up my routine and then also like normally i would be doing a lot more during the day but like my videos for that week or you know vlogging so anyways let me know if you guys like these and if you guys want me to do more of them but i'm not ending the vlog right now it just sounds like i am i really want to just like get dinner and like get in bed and just read a good book like i have not found a book that i'm just hooked on i'm on book 45 of 2020 45 but i really would love to just find a book that i'm like hooked on i cannot wait for this weekend because i just want to like literally do nothing Oh my gosh, I walked outside to take the dogs out and I have so many more bug bites just around my ankles. Like, <sighs> I'm gonna try out the Saturday Skin Vitamin C Overnight um, Sleeping Mask. Oh my gosh. This is my first time using it, but I can't really report to you guys in the morning on if I liked it. But so far, so good. It smells really good. All right, guys, that is it for today's vlog and the end of vlog week. I cannot believe that went by so fast, but I'm so tired. It's like 7.45 and I'm gonna read and go to bed. I um, hope you guys enjoyed. I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.